New accounting system will operate in parallel with the fact that the government introduced only a month ago, in January of 2019. It provides for cashless payments through Spurbank and the payment of the money saved at the end of the heating season. According to preliminary plans, in May to the monetary form of payment of subsidies should join those who will receive them in, in the summer. And in October, those who will receive subsidies in the new heating season. New cash will receive subsidies to old subsidence those whom it was intended in 2018. In March, they will receive funds to pay February's payment in April for March, May and April. According to Tatiana Golubenko from the Ministry of Social Policy, such recipient will be about 3.7 million households, of which 70% were retired. To get a subsidy to those for whom it is intended in 2018, and who is not a pensioner, you need to contact the bank and present your passport and identification code. For grants in April and May, the bank will open for the grantee's private expense. If the designated grant payment system and the real difference, that is, if the subsidy recipient was able to save and use a smaller amount of services he will be able to dispose of cash at its own discretion. Those who applied for the subsidy in 2019, the so-called new subsidence, yet will receive subsidies, on old, in the form of cash to the special account in Oshid Bank. In May, at the end of the heating season, the government promises to perform two option grants and to choose more effective. That is what is expected will be appointed and paid subsidies in the next heating season. The government hopes that the savings on utility bills means people will spend on the energy efficiency of their homes, insulation of houses, replacement of windows, installation of meters. The man who consumes less gas and, consequently, less pay, Maybe these funds to invest in energy efficiency, and further to save even more of their own funds, said Deputy Prime Minister Gennady Zobko. At the same time informed the government expressed concern that after receiving the cash, people can generally stop paying for utility bills. This explained the introduction of cashless payments through the special account in the Oshid Bank as of January of this year. However, as stated by President Petro Poroshenko, by introducing the real monetization of subsidies, which provides for payment in cash, the authorities show that trust Ukrainians, the Ukrainians do not trust. Didn't trust it, because they said that if you give the cash to pensioners, low income, they will not pay. I want to emphasize that I, as President and the Prime Minister and the government trust the Ukrainians. However, there are quite effective views, together with the early payment of subsidies, cash, the government was reduced from two months to one month maximum period of overdue debt on payment of utilities. The exception would be the situation when the Ministry of Social Policy, in which submission is now all the calculations with the subsidies did not provide their pay. At the beginning of the heating season in November 2018, debt of population for utilities services amounted to 43.4 billion wa billion wa, according to preliminary data, during the winter this amount has already exceeded 50 billion. The payment of funds to accounts in various banks to pensioners under the new system, partially answering criticisms that were heard from the bankers about the system of cashless payments for subsidies through Oshad Bank. Then in banking circles told about the violation of competition. However, it seems that the question of choice of government in favor of Oshad Bank for the payment of subsidies to pensioners will remain. Experts also pay attention to the amount of business-related subsidies, which can now be cash. Only in March, according to the Ministry of Social Policy, will be paid about was 6 billion. The total budget for subsidies this year assigned 55 billion wa, it's unclear how that will affect inflation, the payment of such money in cash. My goal and it is not to mar it forever to subsidies were in cash, so people saved money had the opportunity to guide on their own needs, so the motivation was to reduce energy consumption, said Mr. Poroshenko.